what it is, what it is out there, what it is right now. <laughs> Look, this is a, this is a response video to a comment that was left when I was showing or speaking on live proof of how to bend the matrix. I gave a, an example and a solid perception to perceive how things can be bent, all right? Through magnetics, through static electricity, through different types of ways. Now, I discovered this on a science project channel, all right? I even said it in the video. This guy leaves a comment talking about, let me tell you something. This is um, done and can be done by anyone and such and such making it seems like, you know, you go from an intelligent to an ignorance and shit. Listen here. And I'm going to say Mr. Fool. Okay? Mr. Fool. This is why they put things right in front of you. To look at it as just a mere science project. Let me tell you something. And for all those who think or may have not known. You know. Playing with magnets can teach you a whole lot of things, all right? And it has taught many, much. And it is even much more to understand about magnets, all right? Listen to this. The charged particles everybody hold, but can anyone put thought into the charged particle, all right? I'm not going to go beyond, above and beyond to um, to um, rectify someone's ignorance. What is merely said here is that what you overlook is something that you overlook. And if someone else does not overlook it and wishes to research it and go deeper, and broaden the scope as every other inventor or anything of that nature has done, then I, pro I, I, I propose you carry on and don't leave another damn comment on my channel, okay? Seriously, you want to go back and forth instead of recognizing that this is my channel, man. This is my shit. I'm not on your channel telling you nothing about what the fuck you doing. Random guy. Okay? Not one thing. Any Anything that I leave, it's going to be a comment. Alright? And I'm going to keep it moving. A comment to the greaterness of whatever it is someone has said. A comment to the acceptance. You know, not, a, not of all of it, just a part of it, but nevertheless. I'm never going to just drop a bomb somewhere up on someone. And anyone who do that, you know... Check yourself, man. Check yourself. All right? For real, for real. You know? Edison, so-called, when he made that, he, he they say he had 2,000 tries at inventing the light bulb, and he didn't do it. And they questioned him and said, man, you you, you got 2,000 tries here. Um, His reply was, I did not fail 2,000 times. I learned how not to make a light bulb 2,000 times, all right? But nevertheless, I'm not going on electricity. I'm not studying. I said self-sustaining systems that I'm working with, self-sustaining systems. The energy that's in any body or a body, and it's much more in the black body, all right? And it's charging through these, and they call these antennas. Well, I'm picking up something a little more, more profounder than just antennas, all right? And I'm also picking up on that wherever this is, my thoughts can be directed to it. So as you've seen the water moving, it's a possibility through something that I do. Maybe frequency, a, a humming or tuning could have made it vibrate. The same thing. The same way that they put that hose over the speaker, which is a project, right? 
goofy motherfucker. The same way they put that water hose over the speaker and then play a frequency through the uh, uh, through the speaker and it causes the water to go in droplets or look like it's moving backwards and things like that. See, I am studying and I'm putting it out there for anyone who is interested to study also, okay? So because of what the hell you think that this is why black people stay ignorant and such and such, man, keep your comments. Okay, and I'm not going to put too much energy into this, but I'm going to thank you so I have uh, for helping me to make a video to respond to those who think in the manner you do. Like I said, and like you know, or should know, in ancient, and this ain't no black power shit as far as your comments said, stupid, goofy. Nevertheless, in the ancient days, they were we would touch crystals and they would light up. We would touch the pyramid walls and certain things would happen. Now that's not coming off of anything other than the bio energetic energy and activity through thought vibration. Vibration is something that I perceive that your ass don't perceive nor either even could conceive because you're on a physical thought pattern and I'm not doing this for everybody, Goofy. Talk about we need. Fuck you and what you may need, brother. Okay? Simple. You say you black. I'm not black. <laughs> As a matter of fact, see, I'm all energy. And I'm focusing on the energy that's in me to create some self-sustaining energy systems. And that would be, it would have to be the core of the energy. The guy Telsa, what did he create? Was it what is using now? They use it now. How do they use it? Why did he go off track of what they were using? Maybe we all need to go off track of what the fuck they're using it in order to create a more cleaner, a more easier, a more safer way to manage a whole lot of things. If in the ancients they had all these flying machines and stuff like this, they wasn't running off the shit they running off now because they have to re-engineer what they found to certain things of this nature. Okay? Goofy motherfucker. And if a lot of things are made from nature, all right, like the bee and the, uh, you know, the dolphin and stuff, you think they got that much charge in their body and stuff like that? Stupid. What are they moving off of? Goofy. So spare me your dumbass comments. And everybody else, have a great day.